got an amazing cast. You got Mark Hamill, Mooney, you got Jane Addams. The list goes on and on. Yeah. What was it like bringing that team together? Uh, every time someone signed on, it was very special to know that it just felt like it was, as it was happening, it was like, wow, this thing is, is going to get made. Uh, and when you attach that one name that, you know, like a Greg Kinnear or Claire Danes, it, it all of a sudden feels like there's, this is, yeah, gonna, this is going to happen. And this is exactly the type of cast we wanted to put together. We wanted to put together uh, a group of, of actors that could really lean into the sincerity of the story. What was it like creating the actual VHS footage? It was like an art project. It was really fun because you're like creating these like creatures and um, you know, we went back and forth with our design shop who did the animatronics. They're called Stupid Buddy Studios and they were just so smart and just understood our vision and we gave them all these references of these fun, uh, absurd shows from our childhood and um, it was just fun to, I mean, you're truly like creating a animatronic bare face. It's like so silly, but it's, it, it ended up being such a rewarding, uh, you know, special experience. The film on paper, at least from like a plot synopsis, sounds silly yeah. and sounds kind of hard to really grasp. Yeah. And yet whenever you watch it, it all kind of came together beautifully and it's much mm -hmm. more of a character study than it is of an actual yeah. slapstick comedy. Absolutely. What was that journey like for you making sure that you hit all those points and didn't just turn into a laugh fest? Uh, okay, well, from day one, we even when we were trying to get the movie sold to financiers to get made, uh, we pitched the film as, as a more of a drama, more of an, emo an emotional comedy. I, I've also always said that I would be more fulfilled to hear that people were, the audiences were tearing up over laughing. Like I, we, we have no, we don't need consistent laughter in general just because I, I want to tell stories about characters who are super authentic and honest and, and if humor comes out of that, that's great, but it needs to feel organic.